Hello and welcome to a new Rush Hour episode of Trains Out and today we're at London King's Cross the terminus of the East Coast Main Line we'll be seeing services from Great Northern, Thameslink, LNER, Hull Trains, Grand Central uh, maybe Lumo depending if they're running this evening and that will be it there is a pair of Grand Northern 387s coming in, the rear being 387-120 uh, working ECS from Hornsey here we have a quad load of 800s. The one closest to camera will be working the 1718 to Hull. Uh, I suspect that one in the middle uh, is going to be working the 1700 to Edinburgh Waverley. Those two, I haven't got the faintest idea. Over there is an LNR 225 set with 91109 resting up before working a service, presumably to Leeds. And here we have uh, 70052, presumably going to be working a Thameslink service to Cambridge. So, with that all being said and done, let's see what else shall turn up. Okay, now departing is 801213 with the 1700 LNR service to Edinburgh Waverley. Uh, it's also coming in, it's going to be a terminating LNER service from Leeds. LED flickering away there from 801110. On the rear here is 801107. Well, I apologise profusely for this noise. Someone has set an alarm off in the construction build, uh, site next to me. So, I have no idea when this is going to sort itself out, if it will, <coughs> if it will sort itself out at all. Okay, nice party. It's 91109 with the 1703 LNR service to Leeds, worked by Sir Bobby Robson. As we also have coming in a terminating Great Northern service from Ely, worked by Power Class 387s. Leading the way is 387207. 82223 is the DVT on the rear. And 387126 brings up the rear. If that's going to happen throughout the evening, I'm going to go potty. Okay, now departing is 387113 with one of our classmates with the 1709 Great Northern service to Ely. This will be the set that came in 
from Hornsey. So 387205 brings up the rear. Same to you too. Okay, the next train to buy is going to be the 1712 Great Northern Service to Peterborough, complete with a two-tone. 387120 leading. In fact, this was the uh, 387s that came in from Hornsey, I do apologise. Three eight seven one two four brings up the rear. Okay, to Barton now is eight hundred one oh three with the seventeen eighteen LNR service to Hull. First calling point will be Peterborough. Okay, the next train to arrive from underneath the tunnel, underneath the tunnel, through the tunnel, get it right, use your words, uh, is going to be a terminating LNR service from Lincoln Central, courtesy of 800 208. Okay, and the next train to emerge is going to be a terminating Thameslink service from Cambridge. And this will be worked by 700 001. Not exactly full to capacity, it must be said. Okay, now departing is 700052 with a 1722 Thameslink service to Cambridge. Plenty of space on board. Tried to remove some graffiti at some stage from the looks of it. Okay, 
And the next train to arrive is going to be a terminating LNR service from Leeds. Works by 801 228. Yeah, a fair few people on board that train. Ooh, squeaky break time. Lovely job. Okay, now to passing is 801-223 with a 1730 LNR Azuma service to Edinburgh Waverley. First calling point will be Peterborough. Looks like it's going to be a full service. Okay, the next train drive will be a terminating Great Northern service from Kings Lynn, worked by Paraclass 387s, with the lead being 387128. And 387208 brings up the rear. Fair few people on board this service. And some of them even giving me the weird look, as if to suggest that I'm committing some sort of major crime. Who knew? Okay, now departing is the 1733, well now a late running 1733. LNR service to Harrogate works by 800 108. First calling point for this service will be Stevenage. It's great to see these trains absolutely full. Okay, now departing is the 1739 Great Northern service to Kings Lynn. 387126 leading this set away. As we also have coming in a terminating LNR service from Edinburgh Waverley. 207 now brings up the rear. And here we have 801226.
plenty of people on board this service as well. Okay, coming in now is going to be a pair of 387s, 387-125 leading, it's working in ECS from Hornsey, 387-108 is on the rear. I thought I could hear something in the tunnel. Okay, the next train to arrive is a terminating Hull Trains Paragon service from Hull. This will be worked by 802-305. Uh, As now departing is the 1748 LNER service to Leeds. 801-107 leading this away. 802.304 is the rear 802 on that whole service that just came in. And 801.110 is now on the rear of this. Lovely job. Okay, the next train to arrive is going to be 800-105 with a terminating LNER service from Edinburgh Waverley. Gets to rest here for a while before making another northbound journey somewhere. The 800 down in the distance will be working a service to Skipton. There's a fair few people on this train as well. I do prefer the LNR livery to the Hull livery, if I'm honest. It just complements the 800 series a little bit better. Okay, the next train to arrive is a terminating Thameslink service from Cambridge, worked by 700058. a few empty seats on board this train.
Et voilà. Okay, now departing is 700-001 with a 17.52 Thameslink service to Cambridge. Okay, the next train to arrive is 801103 with a terminating LNAR service from Leeds. As the customary sirens blare out, it wouldn't be a trip to London without the customary sirens. And on the rear is 801109. As 802304 gets her windscreen cleaned. That will eventually be working as service to Beverly. Unfortunately, you won't be seeing any services from Grand Central or Lumo. The Bradford Interchange Grand Central service was cancelled. So, uh, unless there's going to be one making a surprise appearance, they won't be featured. I'm slightly surprised that Lumo don't have a rush hour service from uh, London to Edinburgh or vice versa. Mind you, it's rush hour at the moment, and you've got what? One, two, three, four, five, six. You've got seven trains in here at the moment. Hardly, uh, hardly bustling to capacity, is it? And yet all the trains are leaving full. So you've got to think at some stage or another, they're going to have to start implementing uh, more busier timetables you would think. Okay, to part now is the 1800 LNR service to Edinburgh Waverley, worked by 801-228. First calling point for this Azuma is going to be York. So she's going to be stretching her legs for a good old while before she gets to have a brief pause. Okay, the next range arrives a terminating Great Northern service from Ely, worked by a pair of class 387s. Lead on the way will be 387114. Seven one oh seven brings up the rear, complete with a knackered window. It's quite an impressive lineup. <laughs> As now departing is the eighteen oh three LNER service to Skipton. Worked by 800 208. Okay, now departing is the 1809 Great Northern service to Kings Lynn with 387108 now leading the way.
and 125 makes a hell of a racket on the rear. Our game to now is the 1818 LNER service to Newcastle. Worked by 801226 as yet more sirens blare across the capital. First calling point will be Peterborough. As we also have coming in a terminating Thameslink service from Cambridge, worked by 700 004. As we also have coming in a terminating LNER service from York. Worked by 801 205. Plenty of dirt on 004. I don't know why I did a complete pro weather, I could have just gone the other way, but yeah, it works. Again, our departing is 700 with the 1822 Thameslink service to Cambridge. Very nice indeed. Okay, the next train to make an appearance is going to be a terminating LNR service from Harrogate. This will be worked by 800 206. few people on board. Guards whistles are plenty. Okay, and now departing, uh, whilst having, I presume, their family being waved off there, 
is uh, 801 sorry, 800 105 with the 1830 LNER service to Edinburgh Waverley. Loads of people on board, as uh, also coming out from the tunnel will be an LNR 225 set working ECS from Fern Park Reception. Leading the way is 82208. On the rear is one of my personal favourites, 91110 Battle of Britain Memorial Flight. Gorgeous vinyls on that 9 to 1. Okay, I'm going to do an about turn so I can hear some noises. Courtesy of 387127. Presumably with a terminating service from Kings Lynn. Three eight seven two zero six brings up the rear. Lovely job. Again, our departing a few minutes late is the 1829 Great Northern service to Kings Lynn. No, no, I tell a lie, this is going off to Peterborough. Uh, 387 208 leading, I think this is the heavily delayed 1812 Great Northern service to Peterborough. So I'll have to check the uh, arrival point of the other 387s that came in. Uh, 387128 brings up the rear of this. Not many people on board that train. As now to party is 801109. Uh, with an LNR service bound for Bradford Foster Square. This will be the 1833 service. 801103 will bring up the rear. Okay, and the next train to arrive is going to be a LNR Azuma uh, with a service from Edinburgh Waverley. This will be worked by 801201. The pair of 387s earlier were going to Peterborough, while well, their real-time trains are showing the service is cancelled. The 387s that came in 
were from Kings Lynn and down there that service will be going to Kings Lynn. It should be going in the next minute or so. Thank you, Squeaky. And in fact, now departing is the 1839 Great Northern service to Kings Lynn. So, 387107 is now leading. With 114 now on the rear. Okay, it's parted now is the 1848 Hull Trains Paragon service to Beverly with 802 304 leading. And Eto 2305 now brings up the rear. As also coming in as a terminating Thameslink service from Cambridge worked by 700 032. Okay, then getting ready to depart will be 700-004 with the 1852 Thameslink service to Cambridge. Thank you very much. Okay then, heading off now is 801201, off to Bounds Green Depot. As we have incoming, a terminating LNR 225 set from Leeds. See the DVT behind uh, there, or oh, we're just going to get the numbers just in time. So, 82211 is leading the set in. And 
and on the rear is 91130 Lord Mayor of Newcastle. And as she rolls in, I shall leave it there. Thank you all very much for watching. It is greatly appreciated. If you have enjoyed this today, then please do like and subscribe. Feel free to leave a comment. I do go back to them as and when I get the opportunity to. I have thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed my time filming here. Uh, King's Cross is always an amazing station to come to for the rush hour period. More so because you do get the 91 still running around, so I'm never going to say no to them. Uh, Peter the Grand Central weren't making an appearance, but you can't win them all. Uh, my next rush hour film is going to be from Tamworth on the West Coast Main Line. Always really enjoy filming there uh, as you get the cross country route along there as well. So, until next time, from me here at London King's Cross, I shall see you all later. Take care, guys. Goodbye.